Hey guys, I want to talk about the types of pilot shoots. So we've done a series of videos here with the different kinds of pilot shoots, and I just want to sum up here and compare the four different kinds of pilot shoots we generally see. The unvented, apex vented, ring vented, and F-111 pilot shoots. So let's review the types of venting on pilot shoots that we've talked about in the previous videos, and what the differences between them are all at once here. The four main types of pilot shoots and their venting are unvented, apex vented, ring vented, and F-111 pilot shoots. All these pilot shoots behave a little bit differently, but we should remember that they are all perfectly acceptable, and every single one has been used successfully for hundreds of jumps without any issues. If you're operating at the margins, these differences become important, but for most jumpers, this is a matter of personal preference. An unvented pilot chute has no stabilizing vent and will have the worst stability of any pilot chute. However, it has the least pressure loss during inflation and therefore experiences the lowest overall hesitation rate. The apex vented pilot chute has a stabilizing vent placed at the center or apex and has a substantial improvement in stability. It has very good stability. However, it experiences more pressure loss through the apex vent during pressurization and therefore we see a higher hesitation rate with the apex vented pilot chute. Ring vented pilot chutes have a stabilizing vent placed in a ring around the top of the pilot chute, which creates a more efficient vent and actually gives us better stability than the apex vented pilot chute. In addition, they have the advantage that there is very little pressure loss because the vent hangs at the very bottom during initial expansion. That means that the ring vented pilot chute has a much lower hesitation rate than the apex vented pilot chute. F111 pilot chutes vent air continuously along the entire porous top surface. That means they experience the very best stability of any pilot chute. They're more stable than any ZP pilot chute, no matter how well vented. But that also means that they have the highest pressure loss and therefore experience the most hesitations of any pilot chute. Most jumpers using F111 pilot chutes are using them for longer delays and are simply planning in the hesitation and pulling a second or so higher than on a comparable jump using a ZP pilot chute. These are our four main kinds of pilot chutes. There's a lot of variations, but this is a basic grounding in the four basic types.